This tutorial will show you how to create and manage one-click presets for the Lanier multifunction copier printer. Presets can help you quickly print a document using the settings you normally prefer. You can set up several presets for different types of documents and print jobs that you regularly do. From the document you want to print, click the print icon or click file print. The print window opens. Select your Lanier multifunction copier printer, whatever the name for that is in your listing, and click the properties button. If you have not made any changes to your default view, you will be viewing the one-click presets tab. There are a few predefined presets from the manufacturer. One is called basic setting and it's always present to take you back to the default setting. The other three define some uh, preset two-on-one printing jobs and two-sided jobs. If you have some print configurations you regularly use, you can define your own presets for them. For example, let's say you frequently use the settings of portrait, two-sided, and staple at the top left. You can define a preset for this. First make the changes to the current settings so that we will click the detailed settings tab. Now click the basic menu. On the basic menu screen click the orientation setting and choose portrait. Now to change to two-sided click the edit menu and click the two-sided setting and select long edge bind which is what you usually use for portrait type printouts. Now to add the staple setting click the finishing menu and click the staple setting and choose top left. We've made these three settings but you could also change a lot of other things like for instance the number of copies reduce and enlarge settings or any other setting that's in there as part of your preset. When you have the settings like you want it's time to define this as a preset. So click the one click presets tab. So now you see the one click preset list select unregistered and click the register current settings button at the bottom. This window pops up when you're registering a new setting, so in the preset name field give your setting a name. We'll use two-sided staple. Now you can optionally enter a comment. For example, you might want to more fully describe the setting. So in this case you could enter portrait, two-sided, long edge, staple at top left. This is an optional field, but sometimes it's helpful to explain what all the settings do in it, just for your future reference. When you've got the settings like you want them, press OK to create the preset. Your new preset now shows up on the list and can be selected at any time. Just click the preset and click OK. This finishes the job properties settings and takes you back to the print window where you can then make any changes you need to the number of copies or the pages to print, whatever changes are on this screen, and then you can click OK to print the job. So now we've created this new preset, but there's one more thing we can do which is adjust the position of that preset on the list. So to do this you click the Manage Preset List button. Now select the preset you want to move in the list and click the up or down buttons to adjust its position to the place you want. If you need to delete a preset, select it and click the Delete button. Note that you cannot delete the system generated presets that come with this application.
When you're done adjusting the position of the preset, click OK to finish this change. So that's how you create and manage presets. Thanks.